Hi everyone, Liz here with Garden Happy. In today's video, I'm gonna do an unboxing and product review on my new Hysia garden slash rain boot. They just sent me the boots in the mail today and I'm super excited. I can't wait to open them, see what they look like and start enjoying them. And just so you know, this company Hysia or Hysia, not sure how to pronounce it. They're not paying me to make this video. I'm receiving no money at all to say the things I'm about to say. However, they did send me these boots for free. And here they are. It's a nice sturdy box. Okay, now for the best part. I cannot wait to open them up. I know they're gonna be so pretty. Huh. Looks like a little, I'm not really quite sure what this is, some kind of an app or something. Look at how nice they're boxed. Nice paper. Oh, they're so pretty, look. They are so pretty. They're actually more pretty in person. When I saw pictures of them, I knew they were pretty, but oh my goodness, in person the colors are so vibrant. Okay, now I'm gonna put them on. So this company reached out to me and they said, hey, if we send you some garden boots, would you be willing to wear them? Give them a try, enjoy them in your garden, in the chicken coop. And then after you wear them for a few weeks or months or days, whatever, would you like to do a review on your YouTube channel? And I'm like, heck yeah, I live in garden and rain boots because my rooster always pecks my legs when I come out to see him. So these are really gonna help. Oh, they're super comfortable. I think they look really cute too. They fit perfect. So normally I wear a size seven and a half shoe. So I went with these size eight boots. They don't come in half sizes, so I would have either had to have gotten a seven or an eight. Okay, so the boots definitely run true to size, maybe even a little bit on the smaller side because my toe almost touches the end. So if you wear a size seven shoe, I would go with the size eight boots. So far, I really like these boots. I just love the colors. They come in all different colors and I just love the way they feel. So the true test is gonna be wearing them out in my garden and in my chicken coop. So I'm gonna film videos each day and put them all together and give you a really, really good review of these Hissia garden boots. Stay tuned. Okay, let's start with test number one, the comfort test. I figured if these boots are comfortable enough to dance in, they'll be comfortable enough to work in. And so far they're passing the comfort test with flying colors. And while you're enjoying my opening act, I'd like to take this opportunity to inform you that Hysia offers a lifetime warranty on all their products. Okay, that was fun and all, and now we know the boots are extremely comfortable. But how will they hold up in the garden, especially my muddy garden? Test number two will be for durability. Trust me, no one is harder on boots than I am. And I can't think of a better way to test them than to just get down and dirty in the garden, especially a muddy garden. So while I'm putting my boots to the durability test, I figured this would be a great time to plant my Bare Root Double Delight Hybrid Tea Rose. And while I'm at it, I'm also going to share some more boot facts with you, because this is a review after all. 
Hysia boots are designed and developed in Long Beach, California and manufactured all around the world. Hysia boots are made from a lightweight and flexible neoprene material, making them extremely comfortable. Yep, I can vouch for that. And some of the styles even come with these convenient little handles on each side of the boot, making the boots easy to put on and easy to take off. Okay, now it's time to get this beautiful rose in the ground. Hopefully, by planting it in this tire, my big dog Rosie won't be tempted to dig it up. Okay, now I'm going to pack it in and give it a good drink of water. And speaking of water, I'm going to take you out to my front yard where I'm going to conduct test number three, the water test. And in my opinion, this is going to be the best part of the whole video. So far so good. These boots are cute, comfortable, and durable. But the biggest question is, are they really waterproof? Well, I'm gonna put that to the test. And now for the best test of all, the waterproof test. And yes, I'm really gonna stand inside my water fountain. This company claims their boots are waterproof, but I just have to see it to believe it. And now for the results. If I take my boots off and my socks are dry, then these boots are a winner. So yes, these boots really are 100% waterproof and they're so comfortable, I could dance in them. They definitely passed the Garden Happy Test and now they're my new favorite boots. Thanks for watching.